This battle was between two nations, Ghana and Morocco. We left here with the fullest of support from the government of the Republic of Ghana. We had hopes. It got to a time we thought that we should step down. You know how it is when you are in, a, in the northern part of Africa. The machinations, the agenda, the intimidation, removing us from our hotels, trying all means to make sure that it doesn't happen. Strategies, agenda of the assembly changed twice. But this man here, the deputy minister for youth and sports, who took by the decision of the minister, represented the minister in Morocco, really showed that the Ghanaian politician understands the meaning of politics. At all times, this man, from the very minute that he arrived, 30 minutes before the General Assembly, he arrived at the airport, moved straight to the assembly, where the Moroccan sports minister was seated. He made sure he delivered the message as was given to him by the President of the Republic. The election was conducted with his support, with the support of the government of Ghana. Everything was possible for us. I want to use this medium to say a very big thank you to the President of the Republic for giving the go-ahead that a Ghanaian can also do it. Then we can start, that we can do it, that the inclusiveness, Ghana is capable. Yes, Ghana, we can. We have a president who is able. It's a fact that international media, the international federations are happy for Ghana winning. Let me use this moment to assure everybody, those who supported me, we have made it. It is time to work. Let me give a very big thank you to the African NPCs, especially our brothers from the Western African sub-region. Our brothers from the Western African sub-region. They proved that the victory for Ghana is a victory for West Africa. They really understood the message. As I said, it got to a time I almost stepped down. I will need all of us to guide me. My brother Ben Nunu Mensa, he continued to send me messages. Samson, you can do it. I wanted to be there, but we will stay here and pray for you. Senior, it worked. The Director General of the National Sports Authority. Sir, I'm most grateful. My brother, Abdul Majid Bawa, and finally, Minister yeah. and Chief Director, the Honorable yeah. Minister for Youth and Sport, hey. Honorable Mustafa Yusuf. Yeah. Yeah. He is a great man. Yeah. If he had not approved, yeah. I wouldn't have made it. Yeah. Not forgetting his able Chief Director, yeah. Al Haj Afiz Hadam. The media here, yeah. I want you to go. Thank you all and inform the President of the Republic of Ghana yeah. that the honor is his. Yeah. As he represents the Republic of Ghana, yeah. we will work for him. Yeah. We will work and make sure that inclusiveness yeah. is at the prime of our hearts. Well, I think that for somebody in the Olympic movement, uh, it's so significant that uh, Samson Dean deserves all the praise and all relations and uh, the highest honor and respect that we as people can give him. Uh, as we speak now, Ghani is the Ghanaian who has ever attained the highest position in both the Olympic and Paralympic movement. And for him to achieve such a fate, I think that uh, he deserves uh, all the praise that uh, we can give. Uh, he has done his homework well. He's loved within the Paralympic movement. And for that reason, um, he was going to win. What he tells us as Ghanaians is that we have the ability and the capability to rise to any 
highest position uh, in sports. Thank you.